Hey friends. All right, so Madison is just chilling, watching her shows. Yes, she's watching TV because I'm about to log on and meet with the nutritionist. So excited. I'm kind of nervous too. Um, I haven't updated this, but um, I did mention in my previous post uh, that the home nurse came out. They also weighed Madison. Now, at her two-year appointment, she was 22.2 pounds, and her pediatrician told me that she was underweight. They weighed her yesterday, and she was 21.4 pounds, which means she's going down. She's supposed to be going up. We we're trying to hit 24 or 25 pounds by July when she goes back in for her weight check and her growth check and all that fun stuff. <sighs> it's so hard. Like I've never had a problem with any of my children just not wanting to eat food. Like all of them, they've always loved food. They've been big eaters. But then we have this girl right here, Mrs. Picky Pants, Mrs. Brand Specific, Mrs. We wish Gerber would sponsor us because, you know, she loves Gerber macaroni and cheese. Anyways, so yeah, um, I'm getting ready to log on. It's actually time right now. So I will update you guys on what she says. All right, so we're not going to be doing her um, meeting with the nutritionist because she had something come up, an emergency meeting, and we got moved to Monday now. So, yay, Monday we're going to meet with the nutritionist. <laughs> and about Madison's weight, it's very concerning because she was already underweight to begin with, and now her weight has gone down, but she has been sick. But... Like she hasn't been wanting to eat her regular foods and we just bought her these um, protein cookies and gave her one and she took like a little teeny tiny bite out of it and then she chucked it across the room. So I'm guessing she doesn't like them. <sighs> Suggestions, anyone? She doesn't like smoothies. She's not a big fan of ice cream. She doesn't like pudding. <laughs> um, yeah, we don't want to mess with her macaroni by adding anything to it because that's one of her safe foods and we don't want to scare her away from that food. So, suggestions, anybody help? <laughs>